playing with my kids and after I go to bed at 11 pm so this is my daily routine but uh, sir not my daily routine because most of the time i used to go night patrolling so this is my daily routine but usually i do this type mm -hmm. like sometimes you have to go for night shift also yes sir i go to night patrolling so a patrolling okay yes, like on a bike or something yes sir, yes, sir. nice nice all right so how long have you been working uh, as a police officer? Like, Sir, I have been working since 2014, sir. 14? You're from the 14 months. Okay. Yes, sir. And how's the weather in Ratlam these days? Is it like cold? Yes, sir. It is cold weather. Yes, so how do you manage your night patrolling? Like, I you would have to wear a jacket or something? Yes, sir. I wear woolen clothes and then I go to my patrolling. And sir, today's topic nice. is very interesting. I have gone through yes. in my topics and uh, session notes. So uh, the topic is my real life story because this type of incident took place with me in my real life, sir. Okay, you, you can tell me about it, yes. Sir, that incident, sir? Yes, yes, yes. So, this is very interesting, sir. It is, tell sir, me, tell uh, me. 10 years ago, sir. I know, sir, date and whatever because. Uh, I went to police at police station my first time in my life. So, 26 April 2012, sir. Early morning, police came at my home and mm. they, they knocked the door. My father opened the door and my father shocked. What is this? And then my father asked, sir, what happened? And then police personnel said, Where is Vishal? My father told what happened, sir. So then they told, call Vishal and we will talk him. And then my father called me. And when I reached there, then they asked me, you are Vishal? I said, sir, yes, I'm Vishal. You have to come with us at police station. Mm. I'm also shocked and scared. Sir, what is this? Just tell me what happened. And... My whole family member were looking at me and I was also looking at. Then my father told me, go with them and we are also coming with you. Mm. And then I reached the police station and uh, then police person asked me only one question. Why are you following that girl? And I also <laughs> choked her. I asked her, I don't know any girl and why are you saying this type? Hmm. Then the police person called a girl and asked him, this is the person who is following you. Hmm. Then the girl told her, sir, this is not. Then I feel, <laughs> then I feel relaxed because yeah. I was absolutely, absolutely blanked, sir, because this is the first time I go to police station. Hmm. But the, then police person said, sorry, bro. I pick up the wrong person. For <laughs> <laughs> reason, what was the reason behind this, sir? Uh, I asked him, police person, sir, why did you come in my home? Uh -huh. They told me, sir, a boy who lived in my next door, that name was also Vishal. And he, oh. was, following, he was following her girl and he was abusing them. So this oh is the matter, God. sir. He wanted to go, he wanted to pick them was so special and he came at my home. So this is the incident, sir. So this is the real incident, sir. Mm. <laughs> okay. Like, you know, when you were reading the topic, you must be feeling that this is my story. Yes, 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 sir. I'm very, very excited, sir. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> at that time, I, I'm very depressed and I'm scared. But now, I'm, yeah. because I saw the session notes, the whole scenario comes in my mind, sir. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And now you're working for the police only, right? Well, now, yes, sir. I'm working in police department. <laughs> um, okay. So a guy named Vishal was following a girl and the police thought that it's you. They didn't confirm your full name, yes, identity, nothing. Yes, sir. My name is Vishal and my next door is also Vishal. And uh, mm. we both are going to same coaching classes. So this is the reason, sir, why Mr. Police came at my home. So after that, they picked the real Vishal, who was the culprit. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. So they gave him a warning or something? 
yes sir they gave me warning sir so Because what happens in yes. this kind of situation sir i was absolutely blank i don't understand what is happening with me sir what did your father say my father is also said sir you have to come with my home to confirm and then they realized it's happen <laughs> <laughs> and sir after this message sir i wanted to be a police officer no oh, nice <laughs> then you worked for you know to enter the police sir. yes yes sir in 2000 sir, this when, yeah when we we go to any raid and any so i try to confirm two times sir because i know very well ke what happened if you pick up wrong person sir absolutely imagine if someone comes and uh, picks me for no, i will be so i know i haven't done anything but still i will be scared right yes sir that is natural human tendency but i think uh, you were relieved okay i am not the one yes sir <laughs> so this is the incident <laughs> sir ha huh? this is the incident and i have gone through notes i am very excited to tell you sir all these things <laughs> yes 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 this is the first time someone is telling me that uh, this has happened with them in real yes sir yes sir this is real story i know sir date 26 april 2012 sir because i went to first time at the police station okay so what did the policeman say to you uh, sorry sorry sir i pick up wrong person and uh, don't worry about it he called me he offered me water and tea i told him <laughs> okay so these kind of things also happen definitely yes sir yes sir okay and most after that the, you hmm. most of the same time sir uh, the police person do mistake sir if we are without agar if you are going to without confirmation to pick up any person so this type of happen sir yeah it can happen like it's not a big yes. thing Uh, does it happen with you also now when you pick someone up no no sir no sir because i i know the if we go to any person to pick up i try to confirm two times sir the name identity name and sir the, we are living in social media because uh, instagram facebook we can capture the photo and mm. try to try to see the applicants hmm So this is the person, and after they to pick up, sir. Okay, okay. So do you also receive these kind of cases regularly? Yes, sir. Yes. Mobile theft, these kind of basic. Yes, sir. Things. Yes, sir. Mobile theft, text uh, chain, chain snatching, chain snatching, bag yeah. lifting. Because now it is the season of uh, wedding, so this kind mm. kind of incident took place, sir. So most of mm. the time. Uh, Like the special child, 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 ten to twelve years child in the gang. Mm. Like and children are to... also doing it. Yes, yes, sir, yes, sir. Because uh, nobody, everyone is believe the child. Yeah. So that's why he go to and pick the bag and play away from the spot. So when you when you catch these children. do you send them to jail or like what happens counseling yes sir we can't send him jail because uh, age restriction age restriction but we send sir um, child helpline and this kind of sir one stop center child helpline so do they get some punishment also or just the counseling no sir only counseling and the parents are hold the parents are hold and if there is no relationship So relative, the relative, so they proper guide them. Okay, okay. All right. So these things are like are really common. Yes, sir. Yes. Hmm. Okay. So now uh, let me give you feedback because we have three minutes left now. Okay. 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 okay so the first thing is that you know that I think your confidence level is really good. Like uh, when you were telling me about the incident and everything, uh, it was quite uh, expressive. You just have to work a little bit on your sentence framing. Okay. And for okay. that, I would recommend you reading. Like try to read something in English every single day. That is something which you have to do. And reading will help you in two things basically. Um, it will improve your sentence structure and your vocabulary also. you will learn some new words in the process okay first thing 
Second thing is that I want you to focus on listening also. Like whenever you get time, try to listen to a short story, English news, whatever you enjoy listening to. Because uh, listening really helps a lot in your fluency, in your vocabulary and all these things. And try to listen to short stories every single day. And if we connect in a future session, we will have a storytelling session. You will prepare a short story. Okay. That's and nice. you, will, you will summarize that story in the session. Okay, okay, sir. Okay. Yeah. So, do you have your office today? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. At what time? I, uh, I go to sir eleven at eleven a.m. Eleven a.m. Okay, after twenty minutes. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Okay, then and, uh, please keep practicing every day. Like I have taught you daily routine today. You know. Yes, sir. Yes, you sir. can write it down on a piece of paper and you can practice it on your own also. Yes, sir. Yes. Okay. okay. okay sir. Hmm. Is there any question like you, you would like to ask? No, sir. I want to tell you, sir. I want to ask you, sir. Grammar is more important than practice, sir, because uh, I am learning. I have been learning grammar since uh, for one year. Sir. But, sir, okay. uh, I realize that grammar is different thing. In uh, speaking is different thing. Speaking is different, and with speaking, you will learn grammar automatically. Like in Hindi, when you speak Hindi, do you have to think about the grammar? No, no. Sir. It comes naturally, right? So same goes for English also. Don't worry too much about grammar. I'll tell you how you have to go about it in the next session for sure. Okay. 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 Sir. Bye. Sir. All right. So I hope you have a nice day. Take care.